Today on Sly Guys, the surface tension of water. Welcome to Sci Guys. I'm Ryan. And I'm Teresa. And today we're doing surface tension of water. And we're going to use pennies! But unfortunately, they don't make them in Canada anymore. We need to steal these. Surface tension is the tendency of the surface of a liquid to resist external forces such as gravity. The equipment you're going to need for this episode includes a bowl full of pennies or dimes, a glass, measuring cup, and if you want, some food coloring. While we're not working with anything hazardous today, it's always a good idea to wear an apron or a lab coat to protect from spills and splashes. The first step in your experiment is to take your glass and a measuring cup full of colored water and fill up your glass until the water reaches the absolute top brim of the glass. It should look like a slight dome of water. The next step is you want to take your penny and very gently drop it in the middle of the glass. If the surface shakes, you want to give it time to settle down before dropping another one. Continue to add pennies to your glass until water spills over the edge. The water in your glass should now be in a dome shape that rises above the rim of the glass. Let's look at this experiment a little closer. Water is an amazing substance. One 8 ounce cup of water contains in the neighborhood of 7.91 times 10 to the power of 24 molecules of water which is around this many molecules of H2O in every cup. This puts into perspective how very small water molecules are. Each water molecule is made up of one oxygen atom and two hydrogen atoms in a V shape. Water molecules want to stick close to each other. The force that keeps them within close proximity to each other is known as cohesive force. Cohesion happens between all liquid molecules, but because the molecules inside our glass pull on each other equally in all directions, they generally cancel each other out. However, since the surface of the water has air molecules above it, instead of water molecules, the cohesive bonds between the surface molecules are much stronger than those inside the glass. These stronger surface bonds generate a net inward force pulling the surface molecules toward the middle of the glass, keeping them all together. This strong inward force causes the molecules on the surface to contract and to resist being stretched or pulled away, creating an almost elastic tension at the surface of the water, known as surface tension. When we add pennies to our water glass, the water level rises, and the inward pull of surface tension keeps the water from spilling over the edge, generating a convex dome that rises above the glass. The dome will continue to rise as we add pennies until the amount of force pressing down on the dome by gravity is greater than the surface tension generated by cohesion, causing water to spill over the edge of our glass. Water will continue to spill out of the glass until the force of gravity and surface tension are equal. If you look at the dome of water from the side, you will notice that it has rounded edges at the rim of the glass and a flat top. The flat portion of the dome is created by gravity pushing down on our dome of water. That's it for surface tension of water. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this episode, let us know in the comments below and subscribe for future episodes. And be sure to like us on Facebook and follow us on Twitter. And if you have any questions related to this episode or about science in general, let us know in the comments below or message us on Facebook and we'll try to help you out as best possible. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye. You're going to be in so much trouble for stealing those pennies. I'll just say you did it. Oh. Here at Sci Guys, we're always curious how experiments turn out. So if you do these experiments at home, share a video or photo of them with us on our Facebook or Google Plus page. But remember to always ask your parents' permission before you share any photos or videos.